Hi there everybody and welcome to another video. On today's video I have this Mercedes uh, C-Class. This is a C180 W203 chassis, 2 point, um, 2004, 2005 uh, model. Now this video may come helpful to someone or some people out there. But uh, what I have to do is I have to change this armrest here. Because um, the other one, the one I had was completely broken. So it just fell apart and you couldn't really open it anymore. So I decided to get another one from eBay. Um, now, if you're only, if you're changing the arm, it's fairly simple to remove. Um, this one was a little bit different, a little bit harder to remove because it has, uh, it's, it's an import. Uh, this car is a Japanese import and for some reason it's got slightly different attachment so the basic model but it's still the same it's got a different attachment but the same sort of idea here so basically if you wanted to change the armrest for some reason if it's broken or not working anymore um, what you need to do is lift this cover up and you need to remove this trim here uh, not necessarily have to remove it but it's if you do remove it then it does help to pull this out and to put it back in to put the new one back in because to get this out you need to push a couple of clips that are hiding in here one in there and another one in there so uh, once you push those clips you'll be able to pull this up but like I said, uh, it'll be easier if this is out. Now this trim here uh, does pop out. You can pop it out like this. So I'm kind of gonna do it again just for the purpose of the video, since I already done it once. Not that I am wanna do this all the time, but uh, just cause it's not a, a hard job. Um, now that I discover when I was looking into it, it was a pain in the neck <laughs> but now once you know how to do it then it, it's no longer a pain in the neck okay so once you pull this like that you can pull this back as well disconnect it and pull it sort of it, it, it's all clipped on so it needs to be unclipped You can remove this if need be, but uh, I found that perhaps you don't have to, but um, at the moment it looks like I may have to. Right. That needs to disconnect basically from down here. And then once you get this trim out, um, so if you don't want to break it or damage it or do anything, you can pull this silver trim out a little bit. It kind of just pulls out, um, but it, you have to pull it out from the front as well. And from the front is a little bit harder to pull out. Anyway, uh, once you've done that, then you have to tackle your clips here. So if you press on those clips so I pressed one in there try to get so let's try to get a better view we have another one here press the clip sort of back I'm just twisting there a little bit and then this will pull out like that and you have one armrest out. And, um, and then you get your new one. And again, you just have to put it in through those, these holes here. And push it down.
and it will clip in like so and you can close it but obviously obviously before you close it or whatever you want to put this bit back in there as we did before in there oops actually <laughs> the silver part needs to go underneath like that and then these bits clip on the side and we're done <laughs> sort of that's it one armrest replaced um so having done that i hope this video helps um the next video will be on how to remove this at the back so keep an eye for that um don't forget to subscribe if you find my videos helpful and uh give me the likes obviously <laughs> or a super like if you really wanted to and uh, i will um, see you on the next video thank you for watching